Hi, I'm Bob Shrub, physical therapist. Brad Heine, physical therapist. And together we are the most famous physical therapist on the internet. In our opinion. We should introduce this guy yeah, too. Ask him, he will agree, won't you? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we got Brady here. He's a University of uh, Wisconsin Lacrosse PT doctorate student. Right. Right? Yeah. Physical therapist. PT also stands for, stands for party time, right? Yeah, yeah. I mean, you got to be a lacrosse at this. Yeah. <laughs> so what do you want to talk about today, Bob? Uh, we're just going to show how to, uh, the times in which you might apply an ice pack and how to apply it. Exactly. Pack. Now, we've got a video on how to make an ice pack at home. You can look that up right. on Brad. Right. Right. And uh, here we have a homemade ice pack that I made last night. And, and we're going to say, Tim, do you have a backache right now? Here. Yeah, it's uh, me. Yeah. <laughs> he really does. He's but, a smart guy. But actually, last night I used the exact same uh, procedure on my daughter's back. She's going to track me. Her back was bothering her. I had her lay down on the floor. Um, well, let, let's first talk about Brad. I, I think a lot of times when we think about an injury, let's like, so say it's an acute injury, acute meaning it just happened. Right. Right? Not that it's cute. It's acute. <laughs> yes, yes. yes. Uh, that what it just happens a lot of times what you want to picture is that there probably is some swelling in there even if it's a back injury knee injury right. ankle injury i think right. people can easily t tell when it's a you know ankle injury that right. it's going to probably be swelling because you'll sure. see the back you may not see the swelling neck injury so quite often ice is the answer yep. in the first 24 to 48 hours right. particularly if you correct. touch it and it's tender right yep you're not going to use heat on it the other thing is you really can't go wrong with ice. You right. can use ice even in the later stages of back pain. If you like that feeling or you like how it feels, it, ice does penetrate deeper. And so it often, I, I tell people if they want to use ice or heat or maybe the combination of the two, yeah. uh, later in sure. an injury too, they, they can go ahead and do so. Do you feel that, Brady? Yeah, it feels good. Yeah, it typically feels good. You want to get in a comfortable position. If it's your back, this is good. If it's your knee, you might be sitting in a recliner, uh, wrap the cold pack So are you going to put it. this right on the skin, Brad? No, we're not going to put it on the skin because it's going to be below 32 degrees because it's ice and you could get frostbite on the skin and cause some problems and irritation. Right, uh, so, so quite often a, there might be a thin layer of yeah. cloth. Uh, Usually, it's like just 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 your your shirt is so fine. Let's say you don't have that. Um, you can put a, t a paper towel or uh, something thin, something thin, a thin towel. You, you don't want to use a big thick, yeah, thick towel. Pretty hard to it up. Pretty hard to penetrate. Yeah, through. it's too much insulation. Um, so yeah, a thin layer of uh, clothing is and usually how long, Brad? 15 to 20 minutes. I like sure. to go. The nice thing about a cold pack is if you fall asleep with it on there, it's you're not going to get. Over, you know, it's not going to be over to 100 you get right. chilled because it just warms up and it becomes warm. So, right. Uh, that's all it takes, and you can do that two or three times a day if you need to. Um, and you'll know if you need it. When you put it on, if it feels great and it feels good after you're done for the next few hours, it's definitely. I just had my son, he was having, it seemed like the, almost just the start of shin splints. I just had him stuff them right in his sock, yeah. right on the, on the shins. And sure. Boy, by the next day it felt great. Right. So, he, he, his son's a runner, by the way, yeah, avid runner. So. So. A uh, little trick on that, but yeah. you can find out all kinds of tricks on uh, the trade of physical therapy and how right. to keep yourself subscribe healthy. Subscribe to our channel, which is down below. We're basically where our genre is. We're shooting for the people who are 40 and over, and uh, how to stay healthy and fit, and how to avoid pain. Exactly. Uh, so these are the things we're going to cover. And Brad, we can just about fix any everything ex except what? Well, we're having a heart. We're very good at, it, but it's a broken heart, Bob. Yeah, we, can't we can't fix it with a broken, broken heart. heart yet. We'll try. 